Okay, it's time to run my, my daily COVID-19 analysis for the United States. That's exactly what we see here. U.S. coronavirus cases soared to a new uh, daily high of more than 185,000. When we checked that, it was actually closer to 171,000. Okay. Coronavirus updates, 1 million new U.S. cases in November. Wisconsin, Nevada governors asked for public's help. U.S. hits new coronavirus case record for the third straight day. This is two weeks ago. Well, okay, so all, most of this is just old news at this point. So let's just go ahead. Run this. Run the numbers for. Uh, run the numbers for the high for the U.S. So currently, the U.S. is averaging, according to uh, European Center for Disease Prevention and Control, you can see here 39,762 cases per day, 951 deaths, mortality rate of 3.07%. Here's that 3.27%. Look at all the days, including now, where the mortality rate is less than average. The gray line is, is, is the incubation period, the 17 to 20 day incubation period, according to Washington University. Uh, this is no surprise, a massive spike up in here. And now deaths have started to turn back up. And, they, and they've, they've, they're very, on, on the average, they're, they're, they're very close to catching this number here. We'll point out that either John Hopkins or New York Times has this spike up in here for some odd reason or other. So you can zoom in on cases, no big surprise. So this is, this is, uh, so they've had over 150 cases since uh, October, July, since what, since October or something like that, maybe? Okay. Deaths are spiking back up. You can see this here. They're now over 1,500 per day. On an individual basis, over 2,000 per day. These are daily, weekly cases. You can see this massive spike here last week. was the, was the largest number of uh, cases in. Uh, so what you can see here is this is. Last two weeks, you had over 900,000 cases last week. Pre, not not la this is last week we had over what oh I can never figure out what the difference between those two are nine hundred thousand to two so that's to be three hundred thousand past not let's 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 just say that uh, that last last week's cases were close. To 1.2 million cases for this for the week. Uh, the last two weeks again, spike cases spike death spiked up to 10,000 for the week. Uh, but we still have all this period here when it's below, which is why the mortality rate is so low. Take a look at, at monthly debt cases. You can see uh, November is going to be the biggest month in cases so far, as far as deaths. Well, it could very well catch uh, August deaths here also. Unfortunately, so it's already past three of these numbers here. Monthly cases, that's a percent of total. So you can see 10, 15, 20, 25. So currently, uh, November's cases are accounting for about 25% uh, of the total cases. While uh, if there's good news, it's just here, the current months, the November's deaths only count for about 10 or 11% of the total deaths. Okay. So that takes care of the report for, uh, for the U.S. Hope this was helpful to you. Be sure to like and share this video also.